Hi guys. Another share, yes. So, apparently, I am clever. And the ride that I just had, and I'm calling it a night after this, um, they were having a discussion about someone, someone going through a very bad divorce. And they have like a really nice house talking in the mills here um, and they were talking about how the gentleman he's going through a really bad divorce and being reaped over the coals which let me tell you this state sucks for that um, and I know that you know a lot of women get mistreated even myself both but doesn't mean that you have to be a nasty person and men here they get really <clears throat> taken over read and these women are so <sighs> I can't even begin I see that example in my own home how conniving and just how do they live with themselves how do they sleep with themselves at night and rest their heads with with peace they must not be at peace because they're so bitter and angry that that <clears throat> they have to constantly you know what if you chose to cheat on your husband then you should face that fact and move on you got a new boyfriend learn to be um, and a, a big girl and deal with your life and move on that's the worst thing you could do, you, you know, to your ex is, you know, continue to nag at him and, you know, bring him back to court for stupid shit. I mean, that is just like dumb because you're just saying clearly you're not happy. You're a miserable B word. So anyway, she is doing this to this man, which is like, wow. Like, I was like deal with this at home and now I'm hearing about it so anyway the gentleman is a general contractor and does like really nice kitchens and whatnot makes a good profit so I hear them talking and I said well I heard you talking I have an idea I said how about um, he uses his home as a um, you know what do you call that like storing equipment for the job and he has an in-home office and just turn the home into the business and you know he can you know present that as, as part of the divorce and to the judge and then maybe you know give her a five percent not forever but maybe you know five percent for five years just to show the judge your generosity um, and I would start at 5% because knowing the courts and the lawyers, they'll probably bring it up to 10. So at least you have some play with. And so I'm having this conversation with them, the couple behind that I just dropped off. And, um, you know, I'm going, giving a bit more details. This is just general information. And he was like, wow, you're really clever. He goes, are you a lawyer? And I was like, if I were a lawyer, do you think I'd be doing right share? Um, although knowing me, probably, just because I enjoy it. And I enjoy doing these videos now. Um, and then he said, he goes, do you ever think about becoming a paralegal? Because, you know, that's clever. I'm going to have my team work on it. And I said, your team? What do you mean your team? He goes, yeah, I'm a lawyer. I didn't even think of that. You've got a good head on your shoulders. I was like... Score me! Ha ha ha! Um, and, and that goes for somebody, and you know who you are, who doesn't listen to me and doesn't believe, and sometimes you have to finagle and tell little white lies just so that you can get ahead, especially down here because men get screwed royally. And I'm a female, and I see it all the time. So, just wanted to share that because I was like really proud of myself, especially coming from him being a lawyer. Ha ha ha. Um. 
So like, follow, share, and put on notifications. All right, guys, this is it. Till the next time, good night. Au revoir. Good night. Avida, say good night. <laughs>